In Proposition 27, we prove that if two straight lines are intersected by a third line, making the alternate interior angles congruent to each other, then the two straight lines must be parallel. To begin, we are given line AB and line CD, with line EF intersecting both lines. We are also given that angle AEF is congruent to angle EFD. Now what we want to prove in the end is that line AB and line CD are parallel. If this is not true, then the other possibility is that both lines are not parallel and intersect at a point. So let's assume that line AB and line CD intersect at point G when both lines are extended to the right. Now looking at triangle GEF, by Proposition 16, the exterior angle AEF must be greater than the interior angle EFD. But notice that we are already given angle AEF is congruent to angle EFD. It's not possible to have both statements true at the same time, so we have a contradiction. Now the reason we have this contradiction is because we assume that line AB and line CD intersect at a point when extended to the right. So this statement must be false. In the same way, we can prove that line AB and line CD don't intersect at a point when both lines are extended to the left. Since we proved that line AB and line CD do not intersect at any point, then by definition 7, line AB must be parallel to line CD.